Hey guys, Stereo Rob here with Stereo Rob's Adventures. Anyways, um, today we are going to be attempting to power up a Macintosh 1500 tube receiver. So uh, check this out. So pretty much every piece has a story. I was called by an older woman who happened to have something in the garage, and uh, typically things in the garage are usually a good thing, and it definitely was. The tube receiver pulled straight off the shelf. I did a little bit of dusting to it and stuff, and just kind of cleared the gunk off of it. Um, it was asleep for a very long time. Um, she said it worked when she put it away years and years ago. Um, will it work now? Doubtful. Um, the main goal here is to see if I can get this thing to come on without it releasing a magic smoke or blowing up or saying bam. Kind of cosmetically, eh. Um, I talked to a few people, and even my tech said this thing was basically a junk parts unit that you should just touch and pull the, the uh, iron out of the tube and sell that and then chuck the set which I'm just not going to do that it's a Macintosh 1500 so and there's only so many of these left however and we're going to try to power it up um, I do have a Variac and I also have this right here which is an appliance tester so this way that I can look for voltage spikes or anything but one thing about these tube receivers when you bring them up the tubes have a different characteristic than solid state when you first kick them on they draw slow current and as the tubes gradually warm up it will pull more and then cut back down now, if it really starts to run away and it starts to pull away too much power, that means the transformer is at risk and other things and it can go. So as long as I can keep it under, you know, three or four amps, it should be okay. And hopefully we'll make some music with it. Uh, dial her up slow here. Got 10 volts. 20. And it's not really going to come to life until it's about 50 volts. Is it coming up? It did. Oh, there it goes, there it goes, yeah. there it goes, there it goes. Oh man, I wouldn't mess with it. I wouldn't unplug that. I'm trying. There she goes, there she goes, there she goes, there she goes. Here's sound. Got some static. No smoke. Powering it up. You know that's gonna work. For how long? Question. You know, we've got. Uh, you have static. Not questioning things yet. Nothing seems to be freaking out. I smell some burning dust. Ooh. Didn't really seem to like that much. Got a hum. Stop. Don't play with Fuck whistle. Got sound. Yeah. Not much, but. Keep a very close eye on her. Yeah, I'm not, I don't trust it as far as I could throw it. One thing I smell is tubes. No red plate, big caps are happy. Nothing seems like it's out of where it should be. It's an antenna. Now I know that she's eligible to be able to compare with the other one, which I think is pretty cool. 